How is it that two people who laugh together love and dream together sometimes end up all alone? Tell me how it and how is it that two people who dream together. Okay, we already established this is not a love affair. Hey, YouTube, how y'all doing today? <clears throat> okay, the streets, the streets are alive with the sound of conflict. This story has been the story of the week. The story between the fire monster and her friend, Tracy D, and her friend's daughter, Debbie did it. And even the QB monster. They've been talking about this and talking about this and talking about it. I can't, I can't keep up. I finally gave up. I can't keep up. But there are a couple of things that stood out to me. First of all, uh, you ladies, I don't know you ladies. I ain't never heard you going off on me. I'm sure you have if you were riding with that fire monster. I don't hold it against you. But Fire Monster doesn't have a good relationship with her mama, right? So that's another element. Whenever you see a mother and daughter who are as close as these women are, who hang out together, who do things together, if you have a, a dysfunctional family where you barely have relationship with your mom at all, maybe a call every two weeks or something like that, you're going to resent it. Maybe it's not on the surface you're going to resent it, but deep down, part of you, there's a part of you is going to resent that relationship because you don't have it for yourself. You don't have a relationship with your mother, right? So a lot of this is coming out now, the anger. But that's not what I came here to talk about. I want to talk about this, li this libel here. So the fire monster, this is only a little sidebar. The fire monster came and accused these women of fraud. She said that their hair grow product was a fraud. She said, why is her hair the only hair growing? Which she's admitting that her hair is growing. She's been on the earth for 39 years. There's a significant difference when you notice that your hair is growing. You know the length of your hair. Mine has never been no bigger than that. If I suddenly had a big fro, I would say mine is growing, right? So you, you're saying that your hair is growing, but there's, why, why aren't their hairs growing? You a dirty little beast, Miss Fire Monster. You knew that woman was doing chemo treatments. You knew why her hair wasn't growing. It's amazing she had any hair on her head at all because when you do chemo, generally speaking, your hair falls out. But the point is, Fire Monster, you knew why her hair wasn't growing. You said, why ain't her hair growing? If it, if it ain't a fraud, if it... You knew exactly why that woman's hair was not growing. And you came on here and fronted like they were some kind of frauds. All the while admitting that you, yourself, that your own hair was growing. Don't you know you could be sued for something like that? That's straight libel, honey. There's a reason a girl's hair wasn't growing. And as far as Debbie did it, they all wear all these wigs and stuff. How would you know if their hair is growing or not unless they show you? But you knew the truth. You knew that you were using these women's product and your hair had started to grow. That's dirty. That's libelous, Fire Monster. So you're getting a lot of smoke now and people are starting to see who you really are. And I hope that, they, that they're remembering that you and Sean were never friends. You and Sean were not friends. She called you, uh, whatever she called him. She always talked down to him, right? Until the show. She is the one who talked her way up on the show, as I recall, because the initial show did not include her. And then now we have invited these Chicago beasts in this thing and all hell is break loose. Be careful what you ask for, people. You just might get it. 
All hell is breaking loose. Because you invited the fire monster and her crew. Why have all of a sudden her crew got to be all flown out, flewed out? All these people. I'm shy. All right. I'm not going over all the things that are going on. This is a woman's fight. It was a cat fight. But I do want to add that. I think that's wrong, Fire Monster. That you are accusing these people of selling a bogus product. Accusing them of fraud. When you know that they're not. You know the answer. You knew you started using their product and your hair was growing. And you also knew that that woman was undergoing chemotherapy. So you knew why her hair was the way it was. How did that camera get shine on that girl's head? How do we know anything about it? Somebody had to be holding the camera. It wasn't her. Right? But all along, you knew the truth. Fire monster. 